Are we ready? You're on. Okay. 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 Good? Good. Okay. okay, guys. So today we're going to talk about tools. There's, there's some of you guys are asking about tools, and you know what? Really, really good request because this is what keeps our bike dialed. This is what keeps our bike together. So let's not forget about that, okay? So let's start. Um, we are missing uh, the tall order and the Colt. Which other one we're missing? Oh, and the Odyssey one. And the animal one. The animal's right here. Oh, the yeah. animal's right here. So we are missing those. Sorry, guys. I mean, can't help it. The Colt one, it's, it always sells out. So we always, we always lose it. The Odyssey one, it's just nobody from Odyssey ever gives us a call when they have anything in stock. So, so let's start out by talking a little bit about what we need. First of all, it's better if I come over here. So, if you look at the, if you look at the bike, guys, the anatomy of a bike, you have the wheels, cranks, seat, stem, all that stuff. But you know what? The tools we have here is a 17. 17. 15, and the stem, the crank, the spindle are all number six. Some of them, they use a number five. Pretty much, you got that kind of tool, you could take the whole thing apart. So, uh, hi, how, how, how you doing, how can I help you? So, we got a, we got a variety of stuff a lot of these companies are offering. First one we have here is the Rant. The Rant is a very straightforward, it's more like a tool wrap. There is not, it's not, there's no gimmick involved in this. You got your, I don't know, I don't know what would you call this, just a, a, the, the lever. Pry bar. Pry bar. You got, look, your number 17, deep socket. For the leverage. <laughs> And if you have to go, which I don't know how, why you would use this part to go in there. This is the part you're going to use more of. Then you got your number six crank, pinch, stem, all there. But what this thing they also offer is a number eight. Now, this bike right here doesn't actually have a number eight. Uh, the number eight is profile. They have a number eight for the Allen. But Colt, their bike, their spindle uses a number eight. You've got a number five. Number five usually is the C-clamp, the brakes, but very rare. A lot of these other companies, they use a number six. And then they're gonna throw in a little bit extra Allen key, not Allen key. Spoke tool, spoke wrench. Sp Dude, why am I having, I'm having, guys, I'm on my third cup of coffee. My brain is racing, okay? <laughs> I was like, that never looked like an Allen, okay. I know. <laughs> no, dude, I'm getting old, I'm getting old, dude. But yeah, a spoke wrench. Now, you guys might, you guys might think, okay, that's just a ray. Believe it or not, guys, the regular shape one, this shape right here, it's the one we use in the store. It's been a proven shape. It's the most comfortable shape. It's the one that fits on all this, okay? So we got that. And the thing I like about this wrap right here is that it goes in and it gets wrapped. It goes into the tool. But also the thing is, if any of this stuff get lost, you can always buy replacement for it. I like that. Next one is the animal. Now the animal is cool. Pronounce it. Amino. Nope. What's what? the tool called? The Kutalak. <laughs> you know that was their accountant. Kutalak. Kutalak. Katulik. That was their accountant. Edwin told me that. Katulik what? That was his last name. Katulik. Katulik what? Pause. <laughs> Your hair is done, so yeah. Uh, <laughs> but. Yeah, come on, man. You're making me lose track of that. So the animal, the animal jump into the market where they do, they do a lot of cool shapes, like, like the. Yeah, you know what we're missing? We're missing the DK one. The DK, I think, was the one that started. That it started all this, yeah. So, so it it it's in the market where it does all these cool features. 
you got all the tools that's stowed in here. First of all, you got the spoke wrench right here. But even though this spoke wrench is gonna work, but the mere shape of it, it doesn't work as good as this, but they gotta make it work to function with this, right? You got all your all all your tools right here. You got the chain breaker. Goes on. Flip flops. Put assemble this and look, you got yourself the chain breaker. Pretty cool. Probably one of the coolest chain breaker I've seen. But keep in mind, guys, if you lose one of these, they don't sell these. So you gotta keep this thing safe all together. So what so the benefit of it is it's compact and it's cool, but the con is that once you any of these part break or strip, dunzo. You got the uh, number eight right here. Is this, is this an eight? Yep. It, why does it look so small? Yeah, this is an eight it's, for- It's beveled down there. This is an eight for the crank. The number six for the stem. So it's a little small. This thing right here, if you strip it, you can actually buy it. Same thing with this. For the pedal. This, the pedal is what the rant one's missing, but it's not a problem. Remember, it's a wrap. You just go buy the extra piece and put it in. You got the 17 for that and the extension. The cool thing about this, guys, is everything goes in. Look, it, just in case, I'm already confused, but I'm gonna go and follow this. This goes in first. This goes in. This goes in here, I think. No, it goes in the cap. Huh? It goes in the cap. No, what what what's that? It goes in the cap. Oh yeah yeah yeah, you're right. So so okay. So look, this little piece come this little goes like this. This goes here. Goes inside. There's that little piece. Drops in. This guy goes. Yep. In there, and this one goes in that one. Goes in. Spoke tool. Next. One here. Goes in here. Don't strip that bad boy. I've done it. Yup. So you strip that, that screw too. But here's another feature that's cool. This piece right here is actually the hammer. Or your weapon. Or, or, or your weapon, which I'm not suggesting, but I'm just saying, you know. But it comes with a little hammer right here. The, the, the good thing about this thing is everything's compact. You can put it in your backpack you put, and it stows away really clean. The bad part about this is everything's all specialized in here. The only thing I think you could replace is the socket and the extension. The Allen. The Allen. Everything else, if it's, if it's gone, it's gone. That's it. So the shadow one, very similar design. Very similar design. They have a spoke a spoke tool right here. No, no. It's the coffee. <laughs> chain, chain breaker. Chain breaker. It's the coffee, guys. It's Vietnamese coffee. I don't know if any of you guys ever tried Vietnamese coffee, man. That stuff's like, it's like, it's like a drug. <laughs> it really is. Woo! Okay, so this, it unscrews, so it's got the chain breaker. It's not as cool as this chain breaker, but it's still in the cap when you unscrew it. It's got all the Allens in there you need. It's got an eight. A six, it's got a five, it's got a four, it's got every single Allen key size you can think of, and those can be replaced. So in here, you got the socket that all those Allen would fit in. It'll fit in here, and this thing will go in as a lever. Here is your 17, comes in. Right here and you could torque it but the cool thing about this one is they give you the tire leave air the and tire leave air i don't know i don't it, it's a little bit short but you know what when you're on the road it's gonna be better than nothing spoke wrench and mind you it's not as good as as the rand one or the other one but it's gonna it's gonna work when you're out in the middle of nowhere um this i don't know what this is for it's for the chain breaker. Is it? Yeah. It gives oh, you leverage. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. Right here. There you go. This thing has a little Allen. It goes in. It's a little chain breaker. 
It's so, also a 10, I think. This? Yeah. Is it a 10? What is a 10 on here? There is not. Much. Yeah, that. Woo! Look at that, guys. There's also a 10 for the brakes. So, learn something new every day. You can't teach this old dog new tricks. Okay, so we're going to put it back together. Here's a diagram. It shows everything. This goes in. The little lever goes into the socket. So everything's there just, just in case. Just in case you're just clueless like me. And then everything goes back in. Tighten, snug. And then the, the cool thing, there's that little, it has a hammer too. Bottle opener, just in case you gotta get the soda pop. The pedal. So, cool. This is amongst one of my favorite. But again, it's so specialized that if one of those parts break, besides the socket and the extension, all the other parts like this, you can't get the replacement, the lid, you can't get the replacement. But you can still get more replacement parts for this than the animal one. The more specialized you get, the more it's gonna suck. Then you got yourself the, the Merit. The Merit one, it's the most compact one. Look at this thing, guys. Okay. If you look at it, open. Allen key. Stem. That's just a lever. Yep. This right here. Go in there and go. Although it doesn't have everything like the pedal and all that, it is enough for you to do the bare, bare essential maintenance when you're on the road but it's also very small. So very limited, but very, very compact, very lightweight. Because I mean, honestly, the pedal one, how often you can use the pedal? That's why the rant one doesn't come with it. Spoke wrench, how often? So they, they went and designed, they, they cut out all the things. The bars always move, the crank sometimes comes loose, and the wheel comes loose. Then we come with this. We actually use this in our store. Now, it's not as compact, but it's very functional. You got the 15, 17, 19. The 15, the 15 is good for um, the smaller 3.8s. I don't have a smaller 3.8s here to show you. Usually the smaller 3.8s, they come on, uh, like, look, come over here, come over here. See, like we have like this road bike right here. The 15, it goes in. But for the most, for the most, 15 right here. A lot of these are three eighths, but you know what? They did they did the favor by making it into a seventeen. So that's where this thing comes in. There's a lot of there's a lot of leverage for you to pull. It's strong. The nineteen, the nineteen is for some of the older schools, uh, fourteen oversized one. And you got this right here. This is if you went and you purchase yourself like a number six and you just keep it in there. Now that number six could open cranks, stem. It's just not compact, but it, it's, it's got a lot of leverage. It's very durable. Like I said, we use this at the store. Then we have this. This this right here is not necessarily a tool, but Odyssey make this. Why do I have this included? Because Odyssey figured, you know what? Why don't we just sell you a cool bag similar to the rent one? And you could just go out and you could just buy your own tools. Now we bought these tools right here. How much does this cost? How much does this cost? Okay, some of you guys are like, oh man, it's 51 bucks. Granted, we bought this whole thing. All we needed was one. If we were to go out and just buy a 17 and a 15, I think Ito Saka would have been like five bucks. But it's craftsman, guys. If it breaks and all that, guess what? We could always get it replaced. Wait, is this craftsman? No. Oh, <laughs> it's not craftsman. <laughs> it's master. Is it ass man? <laughs> <laughs> That's just you. Okay, so. I don't, why, why did you buy this brand? I thought... Oh. How is that Anna Walt? But look, but look right here. Look, look. The spite of it, it says lifetime. So if it breaks, it breaks, you get a replacement. But see, the cool thing about this is that I could cater the, the tool package to, to my likings, to what I have. And having all this, is, this is good quality. Mind you guys, all these are great tools and all of them are good. But these companies right here, they just went and got the tools and they put it together. You got, if you went out and you bought tools that were made by a tool company, I myself, I would have went and got some snap on. I would got some high end, you know, because no, no, because you know what the thing is that it's 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 a lifetime warranty. And then, you know, you guys, you guys are always talking about that the, the profile leads. It, it engages real quick. 
I don't know if you guys know, but the tools itself, the ratchet system in it, it has the same mechanism. So the cheaper one, it has a lot of play. So when you need to get into that little 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 space right there. How many snap-on tools you got in here? I got Craftsman. <laughs> I got Craftsman. What's the first thing you said? If I... Snap-on. <laughs> snap-on. You know what? Because you can't, the snap-on, you can't just go to the store and buy a snap-on. You have to find the truck. And when I do, actually, as a matter of fact, <laughs> I, 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 I take it back. I'm going to backpedal a little bit. But I do have snap-on supplements at home when I work on my cars. Mm. So... So I would just merely buy this, buy buy the the better the better uh, ratchet wrench, the extension I need, the 15, the 17, the number six and number eight Allen, and then throw in one of those, wrap this thing up, and guess what? That is my own tool kit that I made specifically for what I have, and it'll probably be very similar price to these. So this right here, this right here is about 25 bucks. This guy right here is about 25 bucks. Okay. I think this guy right here is about 20 bucks. These two guys right here, because you guys gotta remember, they have to have they have to open their own mold and make all these. So these guys are around the 60. This guy right here is the best one. It's about 30 bucks. But for the price of this, I would I would also it, it's a fair fair argument to say if I buy this and put on in my own tool, it will be a little bit more than this, but it will be exactly what I want. But best deal out of all this would be the rant one. The rant one. For all you kids out there is on a budget and all that, this is the best deal for you. I wish I have the DK, the DK Random Wrench. That is the, the original one. That's the, the original. It's good. It, it's what these guys kind of like base their design off. I'm not sure if these guys get mad at me for saying that, but it is the fact. They are the first one. If any of you guys want to comment on that, you guys can back it up that the DK Random Wrench was the first one. It's really cool. Then we also are missing the Tall Order, also the Colt one. The Tall Order one. And if you want to get into that department, the We The People tool that's built into the seat. Yeah, and you know what? I was told that if I didn't have anything nice to say, don't say anything at all. So Touché. I'm, I'm going to leave that alone. The the Tall Order one, if I had it here, it was very similar to this, where it, it just has a straightforward, the number 17 and the Allen. Except theirs don't close up like this. It's a it's an L just like this. So the tall order is pretty much pretty much a miniature version of it. I think the tall order it's it's here here and it cuts about that short and it comes with this. So, but it's functional, guys. It's functional. And then the Colt one, I wish I had that. The Colt was here. I would say not because like you know Colts are brand, but I would say that's my favorite because it comes in a very similar bag except it's zipped. It's in a little kind of like um, a pouch. Like a toiletry pouch? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a little bit smaller, and it comes with with some of the tools okay, that I would so put in. So, so we're missing that, but that thing, we cannot keep it in stock. But I'll get that. So I hope that helps you guys. I hope that kind of gives you guys insight on what's good for you. Now, which one is better? I'm not going to tell you which one's better because this one might be very compact, but for some of you guys, it might not work. Like I said, this is our favorite, but no kid's gonna put this into their backpack. This one will fit in the backpack, but it's also gonna lighten up your pockets, like 60, 70 bucks. This one right here, you know, it might be. So nothing's wrong, nothing's right. You guys look at it, come in, check it out, and we'll help you guys pick the right one for you guys, okay? Like, hate, subscribe, and uh, anything else? Hey. So, I think, so uh, what's, like up what's up with that? What's up with the Audi? When, uh, when, when is the, June fourth? June. Oh, man, I gotta go and buy it. I will buy some. Buy some socks. I'm gonna, hey, what's wrong with that? You guys should make some sheepy uh, sandals so I can get some points for that. Oh, I should make that. That's All a right. good idea. Yeah, shapes I got like homework. A, shapes like a sheep. <laughs> <Later, guys. laughs>